in the last class we have seen equivalence relation and equivalence classes and the partition of asset what do you mean by equivalence relation a relation yes on a set capital s is said to be an equivalence relation if it is if it is uh, reflexive then symmetric and transitive reflexive means see every element a in the set s related to the same element a related to a a the element is same element of my right diagram then the relation is said to be reflexive then what about symmetric property if a is related to b then b is also related to a a k b my relation of x is b a diagram now related to a my k then the relation is, is symmetric then transitive property a related to b and b related to c then a related to c a a related to b a b member on b c member on angle ordered for a c a diagram of relation of the one ഈ മൂന്ന് പ്രോപ്പർട്ടി സാറ്റിസ്ഫൈ ചെയ്യുന്നു ദാറ്റ് ഇസ് റിഫ്ലക്സീവ് പ്രോപ്പർട്ടി സിമെട്രിക് പ്രോപ്പർട്ടി ട്രാൻസിറ്റീവ് പ്രോപ്പർട്ടി സാറ്റിസ്ഫൈ ചെയ്യുന്ന റിലേഷൻസിനെയാണ് വൺ ബി കോൺ എനിക്ക് വേണ്ട റിലേഷൻ സെക്കൻഡ് നൗ വി കൺസിഡർ അനദർ വൺ പ്രോപ്പർട്ടി ഓഫ് റിലേഷൻ നോൺ ആസ് ദ പാർഷ്യൽ ഓർഡർ റിലേഷൻ പാർഷ്യൽ ഓർഡറിംഗ് ഓർ പാർഷ്യൽ ഓർഡർ റിലേഷൻ ഇസ് ഇ കൺസിഡർ ദ സെറ്റ് ഓഫ് ഇൻഡിയേഴ്സ് സെറ്റ് ഓഫ് പോസിറ്റീവ് ഇൻഡിയേഴ്സ് എടുക്കാൻ കഴിയും നിങ്ങൾ ആ പോസിറ്റീവ് ഇൻഡിയേഴ്സിന് സെറ്റിനകത്ത് എന്ത് ചെയ്യണം ഡിഫൈൻ ദ റിലേഷൻ less than or equal to r means a related to b if a is less than or equal to b and then s means the set of integers in that set we define a relation r relation r is less than or equal to less than or equal to means a related to b or integer 2 related to 3 because that 2 less than or equal to 3 are but the 3 not related to 2 3 2 never go like that but a 4 related to 5 4 related to 7 now the 7 and 4 are in the same equal to 1 as in 7 not related to 4 no that relation is less than or equal to 1 set of integers is it reflexive or you know that you know any integer of 1 less than or equal to 1 or every integer is related to the same integer you know a related to a because a less than or equal to a since a less than or equal to a is related to a the relation is reflexive what about symmetric property if a related to b then is a less than or equal to b a less than or equal to b or b less than or equal to a or not a less than or equal to b a related to b and b related to a then is a less than or equal to b and b less than or equal to a then it is sure that a is equal to a less than or equal to b b less than or equal to a is equal to b then is a is equal to b അങ്ങനെ വന്നാൽ ആൻറ്റിസിമെട്രിക് എ റിലേറ്റഡ് ടു ബി ആൻഡ് ബി റിലേറ്റഡ് ടു എ എ റിലേറ്റഡ് ടു ബി ഇംപ്ലൈസ് ബി റിലേറ്റഡ് ടു എ ഇഫ് ആൻഡ് ഓൺലി എ ഇസ് ഇക്വൽ ടു ബി ദൻ ദ റിലേഷൻ ഇസ് ദൻ ദ റിലേഷൻ ഇസ് ആൻറ്റിസിമെട്രിക് ദൻ തേർഡ് പ്രോപ്പർട്ടി ട്രാൻസിറ്റീവ് പ്രോപ്പർട്ടി എ റെസ്റ്റാർ ഇക്വൽ ടു ബി ദൻ ഇസ് ഇഫ് എ റിലേറ്റഡ് ടു ബി ദൻ ഇസ് എ റെസ്റ്റാർ ഇക്വൽ ടു ബി ആണ് ബി റിലേറ്റഡ് ടു സി ബി റെസ്റ്റാർ ഇക്വൽ സി ആണ് അല്ലേ വൺ റിലേറ്റഡ് ടു ത്രീ വൺ വൺ മൂന്നിനേക്കാൾ ചെറുതാണ് നീ ത്രീ റിലേറ്റഡ് ടു ഫൈവ് ത്രീ അഞ്ചിനേക്കാൾ ചെറുതാണ് നിങ്ങൾ ഉറപ്പാണ് വൺ ഇതിനേക്കാൾ ചെറുതായിരിക്കും ലെസ് ആർ ഇക്വൽ ടു ഫൈവ് ആണ് ഓർ ഈ ഫെയർ റിലേറ്റഡ് ടു ബി ആൻഡ് ബി റിലേറ്റഡ് ടു സി എ റിലേറ്റഡ് ടു ബി മീൻസ് എ ലെസ് ആർ ഇക്വൽ ടു ബി ബി റിലേറ്റഡ് ടു സി മീൻസ് ബി ലെസ് ആർ ഇക്വൽ ടു സി ദൻ ക്ലിയർലി എ റിലേറ്റഡ് ടു സി ആർ ദ റിലേഷൻ ഇസ് ഫാൻസിറ്റി ഓൾസോ ദൻ ഇസ് on the set of integers if we define the relation less than or equal to then the relation is relation is reflexive and is symmetric and transitive and then certain relations satisfy this property they are reflexive and is symmetric and transitive such a relation is defined as a partial ordering or a relation on a set capital s a relation r on a set capital s is said to be a partial ordering if it is reflexive and is symmetric and transitive is again then similarly we consider and the relation that is that is the reflexive and is symmetric transitive monogram that is what we call what we call a partial ordering or partial order relation then number that the less than or equal to defined on set of integers is a partial ordering 
What about break down of equity? Ah, break down of equity defend the other one again. Consider the relation greater than or equal to, greater than or equal to on the set of integers set. A related to B means A greater than or equal to B at equal to. A greater than or equal to A and for every integer A, we have A greater than or equal to A. A greater than or equal to A or A greater than or equal to A. That is every integer is related to the same integer or the relation is greater than or equal to is reflexive. Then if A related to B and B related to C, sorry B related to A, A related to B means A greater than or equal to B. And if B related to A means B greater than or equal to A. A B A greater than or equal to A and B greater than or equal to A is equal to B. That means the relation is equal to A and B greater than or equal to A. Then we have to look at the second part. Then we have to look at the second part. Then we have to look at the second part. Then we have to look at the second part. Then we have to look at the second part. Then we have to look at the second part. And B related to C, B greater than equal C. Then A greater than equal to B, and that B greater than equal C. Then A greater than equal C. The relation is transitive also. Or if you define the relation greater than or equal to on the set of integers, then the relation is reflexive, anti-symmetric, and transitive. A relation which is reflexive, anti-symmetric, and transitive is called a partial order relation. Or partial ordering on the set. Then, uh, then what do you mean by partial order relation or partial ordering? Partial ordering means a set S, a set S, a relation R defined on a set S is said to be a partial ordering if it is reflexive, anti-symmetric, and transitive. Second, now you give the partial ordering B A R T I A partial ordering. A relation on on a set S. From this set K is not a number. It is not on the set in set of integers. It is a relation on R B is greater than or equal to. Now a relation on on a set S is called a partial order or partial order relation. Equal relation on the middle of all the other reflexive or equal or symmetric or equal transitive. In the partial order relation of the angle E V D is the relation is reflexive, anti-symmetric, and transitive. But it will be anti-symmetric property. A related to B and B related to A, then A is equal to B. Then anti-symmetric property. Whatever symmetric property, if A related to B, then B related to A. A related to B, I have this B related to the angle A by angle. Angle on that angle relation is then symmetric. Either A related to B and B related to A. A की B माय लेटर डालो, B A माय लेटर डालने के लिए इसका प्रॉपर्टी A इसी को डी B A डी। Then the relation is anti-symmetric. Then transitive property. A relation which is satisfies reflexive property, symmetric property, sorry anti-symmetric property and transitive property is called is called a partial order relation or partial ordering on the set. Partial ordering. Is called a partial order, a transitive. That relation reflexive, symmetric, anti-symmetric, and transitive. One is called the other one. A partial ordering or partial ordering. Same. In the middle, S and T S. In this case, the set of integers together with the relation. This relation defined in the set greater than or equal. Now, set two. आ सेट में आपने डिफाइन चेंज करना क्लेश आधे एंड को सेट में आता है डेट इस डिफाइन्ड एस ए पार्शियली ऑर्डर सेट ना ना ए सेट टी एस टुगेदर विथ ए पार्शियल ऑर्डर इन आ उस सेट टी एस आधे डिफाइन चेंज करना वो पार्शियल ऑर्डर क्लेश आ पर एक्साम्पल इन दिस केस सेट ऑफ इंडियस सेट ऑफ इंडियस ना डिफाइन च ऐसे के सेट दो अतः डिफाइन दे रखी नहीं पार्शियल ऑर्डर लेस्ट है इधर एंड से अपना आ वो सेट इस डिफाइन्ड एस ए पार्शियली ऑर्डर ए सेट अंदर इस कॉल्ड ए पार्शियली ऑर्डर ए सेट ए पार्शियली ऑर्डर सेट इस आल्सो कॉल्ड ए पॉसिट ए पॉसिट अरे बात भी बे पॉसिट ए पॉसिट मीन्स ए सेट इस विथ a partial order relation is defined as a positive or a partially ordered set. 
n is denoted by this as n t is other defined the in the partial order relation or partial order in this and this is in the as n t s n t is called a process in members of s as n t is not a member of the order in this case set of integers na the members of the or integer mind ah set the members of s are called elements of the process a process in our order elements person then see as a set of integers na the we define the relation greater than or equal to otherwise less than or equal to greater than or equal to i less than or equal to i and other than i a relation that is reflexive and asymmetric and and transitive one. that is a set is set up with the less than or equal to or the less than or equal to a relation that is either and the same the set is a process and then set the less than or equal to or the less than the greater than or equal to other than the near positive value then what do you mean by positive Set means say set is yes, together with the partial order relation. Our set to, other defined here in the partial order relation. Other set now there do set the relation. Other you are what we call a post. Okay. Similarly, you consider the set of integers now there. You define the relation divides. Let like a divides b. What do you mean by a divides b? A divides b means a divides b means. A divides b is number two. A divides b means b is a multiple of it. Number a divides b means b is a multiple of it. That is why a and b are both the same divided by. Number if a set of integers is not equal to the relation divides, then we have a divided by another a divides by a. Can a is equal to one into b? Number every integer is a multiple of itself. Number a is equal to one into b. That is a divides a. The relation is reflexive. And if a related to b, that means a divides b. A divides b means b is equal to one divided by a divided by a divided by a. And b divides a. B divides a means a b is divided by a. B is divided by a b is divided by a. And the other one is a b is divided by a. A b is divided by a. A is equal to one into b is divided by a. B is equal to one into a is divided by a. That is equal to Mere the relation is anti-symmetric. Ini a divides b and b divides c. Mere a related to b, b related to c. Mana ni? B is a multiple of a. Pine b divides c means c is a multiple of b. Then orang paham c is a multiple of a. The relation is transitive also. Angin satu of ini jenis ni ada. Ada lagi yang divides sama dengan relation defined di dalam. Ada yang lain lagi reflexive lagi, symmetric, sorry anti-symmetric and transitive. Or the relation is a partial order relation of device is a partial ordering on the set of integers second and the definition what do you mean by partial order relation partial ordering positive the same way same way to note like that equal relation more than the other than partial order relation partial order the same way Examples we have already seen the examples of partial ordering. You see, you see now we have three divides line, three divides line, three divides line. What do you mean by this? Three divides line is nine is a multiple of three. A divides b, a divides b. Now the b is a multiple of three. Alikali ye one by one ye thoda bola mai divide kiya. Well, three divides line. Then that all the the relation divides on the set of integers, positive integers. Set of positive integers, one, two, three, etc. Up to infinity. Set of positive integers, zero, one, two, three, etc. Up to set of positive integers, one, two, three, etc. The counting numbers, including zero. So the set of positive integers, one, two, three, etc. A divides b. A divides b means b is a multiple of a. In that set, we define the relation divides. Then you know a divides a. Then that one is a is reflexive. Is it symmetric? A divides b means b is a multiple of a. A divides b and a related to b and b is b related to a. B is a multiple of a. A is a multiple of a. One by one is a multiple of a. One by three divides nine. But nine. 
not divides three, does not divides three. Kan, orang baru mula dengan multiple. Orang baru mula dengan multiple. Ini divides three, implies three divides three. If and only if a is equal to b, that means divides the relation is relation is antecedent. 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 Anteced
ഇപ്പൊ വണ്ണ് കൊടുത്തു വണ്ണ് കൊടുത്തു വൺ ലെസ് ദാൻ ഇക്വൽ ടു വണ്ണ് ആണ് വണ്ണും സെവൻ കൊടുത്തു വൺ ലെസ് ദാൻ ഇക്വൽ സെവൻ ആണ് ഇനി ഗ്രേറ്റ് ദാൻ റിലേഷൻ ആണ് എന്താണ് സെവൻ ഗ്രേറ്റ് ദാൻ ഇക്വൽ വണ്ണ് ആണ് ദാറ്റ് ഇൻ ദ സെറ്റ് ഓഫ് പോസിറ്റീവ് ഇന്റിജേഴ്സ് ഇഫ് ഈ ഡിഫൈൻ ദ റിലേഷൻ ഗ്രേറ്റർ ദാൻ ഇക്വൽ ടു ഓർ ലെസ് ദാൻ ഇക്വൽ ടു ദ റിലേഷൻ ഈസ് എ പാർഷ്യൽ ഓർ റിലേഷൻ But the set is set with these relations is a faucet. Any and any element of integer will be the same. That is the same. Oh, oh, and then, 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 you consider the faucet is set with greater than or equal to, clearly two greater than or equal to one. Then the other one is called the other one. That is two greater than or equal to one. Or two and one are compared. ഇനി കൺസിഡർ ചെയ്ത സെറ്റ് പോസിറ്റ് സെറ്റ് അതുപോലെ ഇത് വന്ന നല്ല ഡിവൈഡ്സ് ഡിവൈഡ്സ് 3 ഡിവൈഡ്സ് നൈൻ 9 3 മൾട്ടിപ്ലൈ ആണ് 3 ഡിവൈഡ്സ് നൈൻ ആണ് ദാറ്റ് ഇസ് 3 ഇസ് ലെറ്റ് ടു നൈൻ ഓർ 3 ആൻഡ് നൈൻ ആർ കമ്പയർ സെക്കൻഡ് ഇനി അതുപോലെ തന്നെ നിങ്ങൾക്ക് 3 മൈ 5 ഓർ 3 ന മൾട്ടിപ്ലൈ ആണ് ദാറ്റ് ഇസ് 3 നോൺ ലെറ്റ് ടു 5 അതുപോലെ 3 5 ന മൾട്ടിപ്ലൈ ആണ് അതുകൊണ്ട് 5 നോൺ ലെറ്റ് ടു 3 In this case, 3 and 5 are not comparable. That means, not comparable, then they are incomparable. Here we will take the S, R, B, A positive. And every two elements of S are comparable. A plus positive, now we will take the S, R, B, A positive. Compare to the S, R, B, A positive. Compare to the S, R, B, A positive. Then S is called a totally ordered set. Then S is called a totally ordered set. The relation is called a totally ordered relation and the set is called a totally ordered set. A totally ordered set is called linearly ordered set. And then the, the, the hour process in other words, any and 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 any is said to be a totally ordered relation and the set is called a totally ordered set or linearly ordered set. ini then the relation are is called the total order or linear order total order relation or linear order relation a set is called like a totally ordered set or linearly ordered set a totally ordered set is also called a chain totally ordered set nu parnal adayana or positive aanu or set ku adinath endanda or total order la or partial order relation undavu adu totally ordered karana property endana aa set nanathulla ed rendu element eduthaar thamil endarikkanam a relative to b or b relative to b relative to a then the set is said to be a totally ordered set or the relation is called a totally ordered relation then if the set is a totally ordered one it is also called a chain then what do we mean by chain a totally a chain is a set where where Any two elements of the process are compared. And the set of integers in the number less than or equal to or greater than or equal to define the other. Either and any element of the number of the area is comparable. And the set in the number of the area is a totally ordered set. And the relation greater than or equal to or less than or equal to the area is a totally ordered relation. A legal total order, linear order. But in that case, set is called a chain. So again, this is a partial order relation, total order relation, comparability property, not comparability property, etc. Now, this is the same way you say with it, not take my time. The same way. Chain, offset, then totally order relation, totally order relation set, linearly order set, offset properties, chain. The same way.